everyone, my name is Illness, and welcome back to the news. What tank is this? SDRV FM 21. It's time to start playing the Swedish tanks. Who dares to pling me on Team Spick? Yes, uh, these the news episodes are going to be slightly. Stop pinging me! Oh, stop! These the news episodes are going to be slightly different. What's going to happen here is I'm going to be playing tier 1 to tier 5 all in one episode because if I'm going to put out one Swedish tank STOP PLINGING ME! Eh, one Swedish tank episode every single week for one tier I will have, what, 19 weeks of footage? Is that correct? 19 weeks? Yeah, 19 weeks of footage so I'm not going to re be doing that I mean, that's a lot and I mean a lot of footage to uh have to deal with in a lot of weeks of just Swedish tanks, so I'm going to do 1 to tier 5 for both of the lines in one video. Now, that might mean that it could be a very, very long video. So that's why I'm only going to play one game. There's not going to be an update video, it's only the tanks completely stocked for the very first time, is what I'm going to be doing for these videos. And that's okay, because otherwise, you know, long... No. Oh, wow. First shot, is my engine dead? What? Wait, hold on. My engine is not over there. Hello? All the tanks? Makes sense? No, this tank. Okay. So, um, I'm not good at tier 1. I, I'll just say that now. I'm not good at tier 1. I don't like tier 1. I don't like tier 2. I don't like tier 1 to tier 6, basically. Actually, the tier 6 is said to be really good. So, who knows? Maybe that will be quite a, a fun tank to be playing. Until then, I'm just going to have to uh, deal with... Well... This. These shenanigans. I mean, I, I can handle that, but... Yeah, yeah, I, I don't know. I just hope I get enough experience this game to actually play the tier 2s immediately afterwards. That'd be great. That'd be solid fun. The thing is, he, he doesn't really give a monkeys. Or... Whoa. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, if you haven't noticed, I'm ill. I have got the dreaded man flu, and uh, I'm not enjoying it at the moment, so these few episodes might be a bit uh, in commentary, but that's okay, right? I mean, at least I'm making videos. <laughs> Come on, kill him, do it. Yeah, do it. Yeah. Oh, this tank looks kind of a bit funny. I mean, it's, it's kind of a shoe, but at the same time it isn't. But... At the same time it is. The Swedish had a really weird tank philosophy, I guess, for their first tanks. But I I assume the engine is in the front, right? Isn't it? I, I think it is. Oh well. Can he do it? Can he win? Oh, what was it? 1 versus 4? 1 versus 5? 1 versus 4, I think. Oh no, he's dying. He's dying quickly. Is it Koblyach? Koblyach? Koblyach. Koblyach. Bye. Boy, oh boy. I think I've got... <laughs> Yay. Do you think that... I think that was enough experience to... Oh, the only one. Oh, no. I think I'm going to start with the tank destroyers first, seeing as they are, you know, free for me to buy. So, uh, that's pretty cool. But I'm going to have to play one more game to get the uh, light tank. I'll, uh... Yeah, for, uh, I've, uh, I've got... Yeah, uh, fit. I don't care enough to play the tier 1. I'm just gonna buy this now. There you go. So, let's play the TDs. And we're back with the... Jesus, Sweden. PVL VV FM42. The tier 2 tank destroyer. Which has an autoloader. I didn't, neither, I didn't ever know it had an autoloader. Oh, it's an auto like this, eh? One that doesn't actually hit. I'll just unload. I mean, I've got enough shells to go with anyway. But I'm not gonna sit on that corner because I've got a gun shield that has... Hello, Lex, my glow. Has no armor. At all. So, who knows. Actually, I've, I have no idea how to play loads or tank. I barely ever play loads or tanks. Like, I, uh... I've reached the point in World of Tanks why I just have enough free XP to... Free XP past most of the tanks. 
See, this is why you should never trade. Just go on, don't trade. What am I telling myself? Don't trade. Not with a T7 car. Jesus. Yeah, like I said, I have reached the point in Robot Tanks where I can just free XP past basically the first tiers. Because it doesn't add anything to the gameplay, if I'm really honest. It doesn't... It's just not interesting enough to just play. I mean, yeah, it, that was a bit of fun to just pew 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 that guy. But more than that's not going to be really happening. I mean, I'm going to be one for one against this guy. He's just going to wreck me, probably. Yep, there we go. Ah, three... three... Uh, 384... I can't read anymore, or talk. 348 damage is okay, I guess, in a tier 2 game? I don't know. I, low tier? Why? I don't understand low... Jesus, everyone died fast? Anyway, this tank is something I'm actually going to have to play for more than one game to unlock the tanks. Because I don't think this was enough experience to get the next tank already. Oh, at least there's enough experience to unlock the tracks in the, uh... Oh, hello. Unlock the tracks in the engine. That's pretty cool. Let's do that. Tracks. Engine. Yes, it's so cheap. There we go. Well, I'm going to play this tank until I unlock the next one, the IKP-72. I'll be right back. All right, time for the tier three, the IKP-72. I turns out I only had to play one more game in the uh, PVLV V FM42 to get this tank because I turned on the reserve. I cannot be bothered playing <laughs> without a reserve at low tiers. But the interesting thing is, hello matchmaking. Hello? Tier 3, Tier 2, Tier 2, Tier 2? Uh, why? Well, I mean, we get this platoon of cake, but... Hello? I mean, there's... I, I assume there's quite a lot of people playing low tiers at this point because of the Swedish tanks. But that is a... I mean, you can give us at least, like, one of theirs to our team? No? I mean... <laughs> you'd almost think that would make sense. Anyway, I'm taking this tank destroyer into a very aggressive position because... That's how I play my World of Tanks. I played stupid and just how I like... Hello? Hey. Something just did big poof. I, I mean a big poof. No, no, okay. Alright, what's going to happen here is I want them to cross there into the middle. At low tiers like this, I can move up, up, oh, oh. Oh, the aim time. Oh god. Oh, Jesus, that aim time. What is my alpha, anyway? Oh, that's okay. Oh. I don't quite know what's happening, but this game is not going as planned. This is, I think, the least I can say. I don't care. I just wanted to cross this. Because now that Panzerossi has to make a decision to do something, and he's going to rush me, so my people here can have shots into him, right? Well, thanks, people. Oh, and then that doesn't kill him. How did I roll for? 103. And I've got 110 alpha. Roll of tanks? Hello? I mean, hello? I mean, I made a terrible decision crossing there. I didn't think the Panzerossi would actually be aiming for me, but meh. these are going to be the best the news episodes. Ever. At least I'm getting carried. That's pretty cool. <sighs> what is the H-35 again? I can't remember what the H-35 is. I knew... <laughs> this is a long ago. I've played low tiers. Isn't the H-35 the Mini Mouse? I th no, it's a normal French tank. I think RT-127 compensated by firing premium now. It's okay though. We're winning! Nah. RT-127 friend got his top gun at least. So let's go. Oh. Oh. This is why this tank has been calling for help. Right. Okay. Okay. 
I helped in this game. I totally helped. Hey, at least I can research all sort of cool stuff now. Let's see. I'm fifth on damage. Put one shot in. Fire four. I helped. I make credits. I'm, I'm, a, I'm an asset to the team, yo. I'm an asset. I am helpful. What can I research again? I can... Uh, ooh, can I mount the engine? I think I... Uh, yeah, I can mount the engine. Cool. How much do I have left? Nothing. Well, I'll be back when I have the tier 4. Savim Frutithi. And we have... Hello? And we have arrived at... Hello? And we have arrived at tier 4 with the Sav M43. Now, fully upgraded, this tank gets a 105mm derp gun. Thing is, this tank is not fully upgraded. On the contrary, it is completely stock. And it hurts. Actually, I had to play... Ooh! Oh. Oh, hello? I had to play nine games in my tier three. Tier three, yeah, tier three, to uh, finally have that tank, or have this tank unlocked. And I have to say, it's not bad, but if you're playing with a 50% crew, it kind of is. So that's something I don't recommend, playing low tiers with 50% crews. It's bad for your health, will to live, and stats, if you care about stats. Hello? Gun? Hello? If you care about stats, even. I care about stats. Hello? Gun? I mean, hello? Ah, yes. We track him. I mean... Hello? I... Now, you cannot blame this on bad aiming. Because I'm pretty sure most of those shots were very, very well aimed. There we go. Finally. <laughs> That's the problem with playing with a 50% crew. You don't know if you're spotted. I I mean... That distance between the bush and me? Unless I was still spotted? What? I... Mm, I don't know. I am not sure about this game. Yeah, I'm gonna play another one for this tank, because this was completely bullshit. Ah, well, there you go. Uh, six shots fired, two hit, one pen. Nah, nah, I don't agree with that. I just simply don't agree with that. Alright, so I said I wouldn't play more than one game for one tank, but last game... Ugh. So, let's try again. With... Hello? Hello? With the Sav M43. I mean, hello? Oh, Jesus. I don't like low tier gameplay. I'm not going to lie. It's it's compiled of people that don't really know what they are doing. And sealed clubbered. And I've, while playing the tier 3 of this line, I kept coming into one game with this certain Panzer 2J player who kept doing the same thing, kept getting 7 kills, and like 400 damage because no one knew what to do against him. And he just rolled over to the banana line on Himmelsdorf and was like, Guten Tag. Ich bin overpowered. Hello. Now I'm stuck in a tier 5 game in a tier 4 tank destroyer that's not even fully upgraded. So you can imagine I'm going to have a lot of fun. Also, this tank is a lot slower than I expected. Yeah, I, I didn't play it on the test server because no one on the test server plays below tier 6. If you get into a tier 6 game, it's usually you are bottom tier because everyone's playing the Udis 03. So I have no real idea what to expect from this tanku. Yeah. We've taken the town aggressively, I have to admit it. Like, really aggressively. Yeah. Oh, why? Experimental smash! I mean, that's basically what that tank does. It just doesn't care. It literally does not care. It's so hilarious to see. Come on, poke, dude. Poke! Poke! I know you want to... Is it happening? Yeah. Hello? Whoa. 
Oh man, I got spotting on a head, sir. <gasps> yes. You know, this game might actually be worse than last game. I mean, I've only fired one shot. <laughs> and it bounced. So, good times ahead. Those AT2s, by the way, they will not care. And I have no idea what to do against them. Like, I only have this amount of pen. 63. 63 pen. And they have 200 millimeters of frontal armor. Yes, I can flank. But I have to get their flank. And seeing as those two are faster than I am, I don't think I will get their flank. Also, I don't know if, if my illness is getting worse or better over the hour I've been playing. But my nose has certainly filled up a lot more. Oh, please don't tell me he turned around. Oh. Uh. Uh. Oh. Uh. Hold on, the S killed him. Wait. There! He's using bushes! What? You can't use bushes? You can't just suddenly use bushes? It's against the rules of all the tanks. Tanks tier 5 noob? Said tier 3 tank. Okay. Alright, uh, maybe he was not really using bushes, but he was just in, you know, out of my view range. Yay! I technically still did worse than last game. Also, yes, I don't have my mods correctly working yet. I would rather have the information here that Wargaming added and my damage battle over there. But nothing I can do about that. Uh, the mod that I want to use for that, the Team HP pool mod, is not updated yet. So, meh, what you gonna do? I'm just... I'm not sure if I will make it to tier 5 today, actually. I've, I've got to go soon. Very soon. And uh, I just only started playing the tier 4. So we will see. My initial plan was to go to tier 4, but then I thought, tier 5 is not really that interesting either. So I might as well just go to tier 5. Tier 6 onwards will be interesting, I assume. Because at tier 6 in the tank destroyer, you get like... Uh, what's that count? Like, the, the, like the, the, the bus? Also, how much gun depression does this tank have? How? What? Oh, yay. Yeah. Oh, yes. Finally got the engine. Good stuff. Good stuff. And uh, I helped. Hello. Yes. Good. What's in the box? Useless. What's in the box? Useless. Yay. Anyway, I will be back soon for the IKV 103. Well, at least for you, I'll be back soon. Um, For me, it's going to gonna take some shit and tier 5 we're finally at tier 5 it has been a few days after I recorded those tier 4 games a couple of days ago I uh, mm, I turned ill worse than I already was my voice just kind of decided to quit on me so I kind of sounded like this the entire time and it, it you know it was kind of fun but also it hurt my voice quite a bit so I couldn't really record any of the news episodes, but that's okay, because it took longer than expected to go past the tier 4. I have since aced it in a draw that was shameful for my family and me. So, yeah, it's, it's a long game, it's a boring game. And in the end, I'm 2 versus 5, but my you know, player that was with me was AFK. The entire game. The entire game. So I'm probably not going to make a replay of that anyway. But this is the tier 5 and you can say... Say? I guess? No, no, no. You can notice it's stock because it doesn't only fire heat. I have three types of shells. AP, heat and HE. The top gun only fires heat. It's a heat only gun, the top gun. And that is kind of fun, I guess. You have higher penetration than you should normally have. Seeing as this has 102. 102. 10. But you have 120 and 140, I believe, on the two top guns. Wait. Hello? Hello, artillery? Hello? What are you doing down there? Can I have an explanation for your actions, please? At least is he... Wait. Why? Why would he do this? I mean... This is a great map for artillery. Why did he throw it away? I don't get it. Hello? Ooh, do I have shots in- No, I don't have shots in the Panzer IV. Hello? 
Oh, the plinging never ends. Uh. Okay. Oh, I had a shot there. I don't know if I can actually make these shots because I've got high explosive. That's why I'm not really firing at the moment. Also, Tank Destroy gameplay. It's exciting. It's okay. I'm pretty sure this T-34 will make a terrible mistake. No, stop plinging me! I'm recording. Shh. I will be with you in a minute when this game turns into a terrible loss. Because I'm doing nothing for the team and the Panzer C is finally taking damage. You know, I, I don't think I'm going to do much this game at this rate. Also, I'm still a bit ill. I still have the dry coughs, you know, that ones that tickle your throat and you're like, No! No, it tickles! No, don't kill me! Oh. oh. This is all part of a plan? I can get myself out of this. This was all tactical. There we go. Ding the map. And then we want him to get spopped, spooped, spooted. I just fired his last known position. <sighs> and now we wait to reload while he drives into cover. Oh, don't repair yet. Don't. <sighs> oh. Isn't that always the case? Isn't it? That's just always the case. You fire, they get spotted. And then the moment you reload, they are back in cover. Mm. All the tanks at its best. Do I even have shots from here? I do. Oh. Oh, keep on driving, dude. Keep on driving. I... No. Yes. 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 Yes, fire. No. <laughs> that shot went everywhere. And now he goes. Oh, of course. Why don't you? Oh. We're all the tanks. To be honest, this is not even World of Tanks, this is just random people. Random people being random as all hell. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. What a good game this was in the IKV-103. Can't wait to play this tank some more. Oh no, this is a times 5 as well. Oh no. <laughs> it's gonna be like 500 experience times 5. Oh lordy, oh dearie me. Oh well. You know, at least it's a win, so I'll get a times five. I don't know if I should be happy with this times five, but at least I'll get a times five. So, I guess there you have it, folks. Tier one till five on the Swedish tank destroyers. Probably next week, one till five on the light and medium tank line. I don't know, are they special? Not really. The tanks so far, 1 till 5 on the tank destroyers, are not really that special. It gets, it gets fun at tier 6 when you have to shed. And that thing is fast. And then at tier 7, it's... At tier 7, it's kind of... It's kind of like an SU-100 M1, but worse. Yes, worse. It doesn't have the DPM nor the gun handling like the SU-100 M1 has. And then at tier 8, you know, the uh, you get the actual interesting bits of the uh, tank destroyer line. The novelties. And that's it. That's basically where it ends. For the medium and heavy tanks, eh, I'll see where that ends. An attempt was made. It was a good attempt. I fired three shots. Th yeah, three shots, and they all missed terrifically. So, Swedish tank destroyers. Huh. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. I helped, and not even last on experience. He did damage, and he drove slightly less, and he blocked damage, and he got less experience than I did. I did nothing this game. I wasted credits, yet I made credits because what is low tiers? So, 1200 experience for my first times 5 of the day. The Swedish tank destroyers, tier 1 to tier 5. Just free XP, yet. Yeah.